Tech News. My name is Hope Radford. And I'm Emily Thomas. And today's main story is plastic pollution. 41-year-old Tim Nunn, who is a surfer and photographer, has spent many years photographing the North Atlantic coastline. Sadly, he has found a problem. After a two-hour hike to the beach, Tim found that this was the worst beach he had ever seen. Rubbish piled up on the shore, our waste covers the beautiful remote beach in some places waist high. The amount of plastic there was horrible. The most common plastic found was Coke bottle caps. Now to our interview with Tim Nunn. Good afternoon, Tim. First of all, what is this problem you've this problem is affecting our environment because because birds and other animals are eating it as they mis are eating our plastic as they mistake it for fish or squid. Thank you. My next question is, why do you care so much about this project? Well, um, I created the plastic project to try and save our beaches and the animals, and I really care because. I love surfing and um, photographing the beaches and when I started realising that the beaches were being ruined by all this plastic, I, it really made me think. So you created the plastic project, what effect do you hope the plastic project will have on the environment? Um, I really hope that the plastic project will save our beaches and the animals as animals don't deserve to be eating our plastic when it's all our fault. Finally, what can the general public do to help with the pollution? We need all the general public's help because if they help, then we can maybe start to get the beaches back to how they used to be. Thank you. I'm back live in the studio. Thank you, Brian and Tim. You can help. This is Max News. Good night. <laughs>